Weather is mares listed hurl, race seven. Day one and week two is a two mile listed race for the mares. So number one is Allegram for Martin Leadham. Two, American Mawson for D. Hinton. Better impressive Daniel French is three. Crazy Angelina for Pontypool is four. Emerald Star for Jim Murray is number five. Epu Law for Tam King is six. Orange Eyes for Molly at Surfer is seven. Trade Wars for Pontypool Racing is eight. Soggy Bottom was number nine for David Robertson. And I think number ten was the head wrecker for Paul Rhodes. That's the ten. Uh, already well underway. Going around this left turn here at Weatherby. It's quite a long run to the, the first of the ten hurdles. And we're being led by Crazy Angelina. I wonder if that's named after Miss Jolie, or Mrs. Jolie, should I say, or Mrs. Pitt. Mrs. Crazy Angelina Pitt. But uh, she's being overtaken now by Bella Impressa. And the other grey who is outside is Epu Law. To this first of the ten hurdles, and everybody skips over it. They're fairly closely knit here. There's ten horses. It's going to be led again by Crazy Angelina. Into the second, nice jump. Takes a couple of lengths out of the field. From second is American Mawson. Third is Bella Impressa, the grey against the fence, the orange silks. They get to the third. There is other, a couple of slow jumps. The grey Epilaw nearest to us with a red cap did well. They're followed through by a Allegram, Soggy Bottom, Trade Wars. The head wreckers there, just towards the rear. And Orange Eyes out wide for Molly at Surfer. But it's still crazy Angelina for Pontypool Racing. Leads by a good couple of lengths to Epulaw and American Mawson. Followed through by Emerald Star and Trade Wars against the fence. And that's of that is the Grey Better Impressor and Soggy Bottom. Still is Allegram, Orange Eyes on the inside of that. Just at the rear is the head wrecker for Paul Rhodes. Quite unusual. And then the horse being pushed along. It's mare's not uh, settling that well. So we're just inside the mile left to travel now. We're halfway through. We've only done four of the ten hurdles though. As we're going to go past the grandstand. This will be the, I think, my last next time round. There might be one more actually. next time round and everybody's got over it and it's still crazy Angelina leads by a good couple of lengths it has been pushed along a little bit to close the gap the one mainly is Emerald Star it challenges crazy Angelina as they take the sevenths and it's Emerald Star and crazy Angelina a couple of lengths to Socky Bottom the one that's moved out of nowhere is the head wrecker up into fourth now they're followed through by Orange Eyes and Epilaw against the fence the others are under a little bit of pressure now behind that's Trade Wars better impress American Awesome. I can't see an anagram, but up front, Crazy Angelina off, off the bridle, but still holding holding the lead for a length from Emerald Star. Headwrecker's still there and moving well on the outside now. He's soggy bottom and orange eyes. The grey Epilaw looks like he's got a little bit to do from there. Running on really well is Trade Wars, but still up front is Crazy Angelina with two and a half furlongs left to run. He's extended his lead. He gets over the eighth. There's only a couple left to negotiate. It's Crazy Angelina from Soggy Bottom. Bottom and Orange Eyes who are running on well, but I'm not sure they're going to catch this leader. He's over the penultimate, but his advantage is down to two to three. Now it's Crazy Angelina with a furlong left to run. One to jump, it's Crazy Angelina. Gets over it well, and Orange Eyes and Emerald Star. Here comes Emerald Star to put the lead there. Throw down the challenge along with Orange Eyes, but Crazy Angelina's going to hang on to this. Well done for Graham Clutter. Crazy Angelina takes it from Orange Eyes. Emerald Star, Emerald Star, and it was in third. Wait for the card to come up, and it is Crazy Angelina for Pontypool Racing. Nice little uh, two-mile two mare you've got there. Second was Orange Eyes for Molly at Surfer. Third was Emerald Star for Jim Murray. Fourth was Soggy Bottom for David Robertson. And fifth was the head wrecker for Paul Rhodes.